guys welcome back to my youtube channel if you are new to this channel don't forget to click on the subscribe button below and subscribe don't forget to comment and like so guys so some few days back regina mother was invited with the daughter for an interview and they asked her why she allowed her daughter to marry an elderly man so she was giving some silly excuses like because she have given this excuse in one of her video before so why she allow her daughter to marry saying that uh the daughter told her uh, that she's going to marry at early age she's going to marry someone who is a mature who is mature who can control her who can undo her stuff like that so like my question is so if your daughter is going to marry at early age and she wants to marry a mature man must it be someone that is old enough to be a grandfather i'm not trying to judge yes please guys i'm not trying to judge here guys but the truth of the matter is the truth must be told because some people were like okay the girl is having a happy home she's happy with the man blah 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 see let me tell you she's happy with the man for now but let's just face reality guys let's face reality she's happy with with the man for now because now what's the assurance now you allow your child daughter your beautiful daughter that girl beautiful as that to go and risk her life in the one just polygamous home just like that you just to me it's like you wasting our time like you wasting our years because now to you allow your daughter to just go and risk her life because doing this whole thing traditional hold of a thing and everything which you know the consequence if your daughter should go out and follow any man you know the consequence so which woman if if I'm a woman and you want, as a elderly man like that, you want to marry my daughter and you are putting my daughter in some kind of condition like marrying her with a traditional, some stupid, risky, traditional right and everything, I won't allow it because I know I need nothing from you. I'm only supporting my daughter. I need nothing from you. So I would never allow it because if you truly love my daughter and if you trust my daughter, you don't have to do all that. But in Regina Mother's case, she did the, she did it. She even allowed her daughter to went ahead for that ma traditional stuff. So which means because now she's claiming that uh, she was okay, she's she's okay even before Regina got married. The Regina is financially okay even before she met the man and everything. If truly you people are okay and you are contented, you don't have to allow your daughter to marry this man now. You don't have to allow your daughter to marry oh, that man old enough to be her grandfather. I'm not trying to judge you, but that is the truth. Because now, the deed is now done now. So you, you are still coming because you are the reason for this girl's, uh, for people to be talking about this girl marriage and all that. Because you keep coming and giving us silly excuses why you allow your daughter to marry this man. Why can't you just keep quiet? Must you follow Regina to every social media thing? Must you follow Regina to every interview? Must you follow Regina to everywhere? Like, because I realize that anywhere Regina is, you want to go to. Because I, I, I really don't understand you, madam. You mustn't follow Regina to everywhere. Now, the deed is done. So, why giving us excuses and every? Why still repeating the same thing? Eh? You, you are even supposed you, you madam, you are, even, you are not even supposed to be coming on social media to even talk about your daughter. That is it. People are forgotten about her. Like, people are now, like, some people are now happy for her now and everything. So why must you come and ruin everything again on social media? Eh? Because me, the way me, I, I look at it, I see, I see, I see you like someone, you allow your daughter to marry for your own selfish interest and greediness. To me. To me. Because you know quite well that for you to allow that traditional stuff and everything, you allow, which means you allow your daughter to marry that man for the money. So stop telling us you, you are okay even before you made the man. You might be okay, fine, yes. You might be okay, but because your greediness and uncontempted, you, that's why you allow your, your daughter, your 20-year-old daughter or 19, to marry someone of 60-something. Haba. Maybe that is, your, that, is, that is your own father's age, you say, who knows. That is too much now. It's too much. Not even 40. Not even 45, not even 35. It's too much, madam. So please, this woman should just stop coming on social media to talk about her daughter because she's the reason why people are like talking about this girl's marriage. Like people are checking out because she she keep coming. 
giving silly excuses and everything. Eh? Everything is for the money. If Reg and then one coach should be a poor man, will you allow your daughter to marry him? Everything is for the money, madam. So we are not fools in Nigeria. We are not fools here. We are, bloggers are not fools. We know what is happening. That is it. We know what is happening. And now the most annoying part of this whole thing. Now, I'm not judging Regina. Now. I'm not judging. Just that she's quite unfortunate to have a useless and or irresponsible mother. Because sometimes, as a, as a child, what you want to do when you're about to take a wrong decision in life, if you don't have parents to guide you and let you realize the reason why they won't allow you to take that decision, you just take it. It's not your fault. Because you actually share that decision with them and they still support you to do that wrong thing. So, quite alright, the blame should be on the parent, not on that child. That is what happened to Regina. Eh? That is what happened. So guys, seriously, but I don't know. Seriously, that was what happened. So guys, if you have any opinion on this whole thing of Regina, you can click on the comment section below and give your whole opinion because I just felt like she coming on social media is not necessary. It's really not necessary, guys.